Get it out! Welcome to another upload, and today we are playing Newcastle away. Uh, before I carry on with, like, you know, the the grudge element of how much I really basically want to beat that team. I just want to say very quickly that obviously um, this week has been pretty difficult for me and a lot of other people um, because of the passing of um, Claude, Claudio Calagari. It's, it's pretty sad, but um, I just want people to understand and know that his, um, his cause of death was natural and... If you go over to his YouTube channel that's run by his friends, it was very powerful, but they explained very powerfully that he had a lot of things to look forward to. I just want to say once again, very quickly, that my thoughts go out to Claude's family and friends. This has affected all of us to however shape or form we knew him as. For me, he was a good friend. That's what I just wanted to get off my chest and talk about and yeah, rest in peace, Claude. We talk about Newcastle versus Tottenham now and um... Like I said earlier in the introduction, this is a grudge match. I am fuming, I am pissed off. Listen, I know what I said earlier, saying that we've got a share of blame to take, that we didn't kill our chances off, but that VAR decision, man. I honestly do hope, without trying to jinx this, that they get something of the sort like that, to make them know how it feels like. It annoys me though, because Callum Wilson isn't even playing. Uh, Maximilian's on the bench, and we're pretty much starting the same lineup. I'm happy personally with that lineup. Uh, Son is on the bench. Bell is on the bench. So at least we've got some alternatives should we need them. Those Chelsea mugs lost 5 2 at home, yeah? 5 2 at home. Arsenal lost 3 0 to Liverpool. This is our chance now to get top four, and we basically have to rely on West Ham to drop points. But anyway, um, Dan isn't here today, so I got another guest instead. Just gonna. Oh, you, you, in, you ruined the edit. You ruined the edit, man. But anyway, um, remember that dancing kid from the Ajax vlog and the Man City vlog? This is him now. He's, he's grown up a bit, hasn't he? Uh, what's your score prediction today? 2-1 uh, Tottenham. 2-1 Tottenham, that's what we like to hear. Right, we've kicked off. Let's get those three points, Tottenham. That's what we need right now. Let's get some revenge at St. James's Park. Please, no mucking about. Just make this a nice, comfortable win. Oh! Oh, that was very quick, that. Just tries to slide slide that in, and the keeper had that, unfortunately. But now Newcastle are on the break. But Sanchez heads that away, but straight to Joe Linton. Oh, my God, shot straight out of the reach. we got to do better than that. This is why I worry about Sanchez, man. Like, he's good at seeing off counter-attacks, but he'll have brain-dead moments like that. Look, just heads it straight to Joe Linton. Oh, for God's sake, man. You can't be doing mistakes like that. Harry! Shoot! Oh, he's going to miss that. Oh, shot! Corner! Oh, who's there? Tangy! Kane! Oh, my God! We're not taking that final third, man. Where is that final third? Oh, my God. Hey, Fever. Oh, and they've got a corner. <sighs> Let me get a foul for that. Oh my god. Have you been getting hay fever today? Nope. I didn't have it. Oh, you're lucky, man. You're blessed. Thieves. Oh my god. What a double save from Larice. Jesus Christ. Newcastle that close to making it 1 0. How did they not score from that? But what a double save from Larice there. Look at that. Go on, Harry. Vinicius. No. Oh, no. And it's offside anyway. No, no, no. God's sake, man! Of course they scored. Defensive errors, man. Defensive errors. That was waiting to happen. Oh, my God. CBA, man. CBA. Absolute rubbish, that. That's Tanganga's fault. Then that Sanchez just booting that straight air player. And Roden can't do anything from that. That's awful defending. Awful defending, man. Awful. I've been absolutely ramming my mouth at Chelsea and Arsenal. And now they're probably going to ram their mouths in this comment section. And you know what? Bloody deserve it. We're not take. We're, we're just being taking the piss right now. Okay. No. Yes. Yes. Come on. Come on. Get in! Equalising straight away like that! 
Happy. We'll take that. We'll take that. Harry Kane on the goal sheet. Let's go. No! God, no! Oh! That close to making it 2-1. That close. Go on, Harry! Go on! Yes! Yes! 2-1! Harry does it! Come on! Come on! Get in! Let's go! Let's go! Just as you predicted, yes! Come on! Oh, that's brilliant, man. That is brilliant. Brilliant finish. Brilliant, brilliant finish from Harry Kane. And Dombele throws that. Kane with the ball. And finishes just like that. Come on, that's 2-1. All right, so that's half time. Um, Newcastle 1, Tottenham 2. I uh, thought the first 10 minutes we were playing really good football. Started to go downhill and then we made that stupid error that led to a Newcastle goal. But, however, our response has been brilliant and now we're 2-1 up and we just got to make sure to carry on killing this game off. We need at least another goal. That's the way I see it. Your prediction's right so far, though. 2-1. Yep. Hope it stays out. Right, second half is now underway. As it stands, we are in the top four. But, of course, with West Ham with a game in hand, so we're going to really need to rely on them to lose now. But we, right now, we need to focus on this and get those three points. But Newcastle are on the break. Oh, my God. Lurie saves that. Right, we need to be careful. Newcastle have not given up. Oh, my God. Almost made a mistake there. No. Get rid of it. Oh, skies it over. Forgot to say, by the way, welcome back. Kung Min Son, he has come on for Vinicius. Let's hope we can see a Son Kane partnership today. That's something we'd all love to see. My God, Sanchez's clearances, man. He's been awful this whole game. Campbell. My God, almost a goal for Newcastle there. My God. And now St. Maximin is coming on. Now we can worry. Now we can really worry. We're, this will not stay 2-1 if we keep it like this. Come on, Lamella. Pass it. Free kick. Yes. Don't get keen. Don't Just bring Bell on, surely. Bring Bell on now. Nah. Seg, I think Kane is taking this again. I don't want him taking this free kick. I want... He can't score from free kick tonight. He just can't do he that. The post there. In deflection. It Hits the wall. Hits the wall, man. Go on, Harry. Go on. Pass it back. Reggie, cross. Cross, Reggie. Cross. Oh, where is that going? Come on, Tangy. Win that. Oh, ooh, waste of a free kick. Oh. Come on in, Dombele. Shoot! No! How's he not finished that? Oh my God, how have you not finished that, Kane? That's good from Lamella. Lamella crosses that, Son. Kane, oh my God. Bad pass from Son. Come on, Son. Go on, go on. Threw it to Son. Threw ball to Son. To Kane. Lamella! Kane! No! Hits the inside of the post but goes out! No! How? How have we not scored from that? Oh no! I can't believe he didn't score that. Get it out! Nice Arsenal. For fuck's sake! Next Arsenal! I can't believe that Arsenal prick has just scored. Oh, that is Sanchez's fault, man. Sanchez been costing us all game. What the hell is he doing, man? Look, look at that. Just colliding to his teammate. Got ourselves a free kick, but do I have any confidence? No. It's quite far out. Yeah, he he in the scarf bale. Not seeing what's quite far out. I don't I don't I don't know. I think this is not gonna be our day. Straight over the bar. Uh, uh, I can't you know what it is, yeah. This is individual areas once again that's costing us. I've been critical of Mourinho before the last couple of weeks, but it's individual error for me here. It's Sanchez's fault. I know Mourinho picked him and everything, but we've been playing, we, we played actually some decent football in this game. But once again, it's an individual error that just has to ruin the whole game for us. I'm sorry, but Sanchez, 40 million, what, however much we signed him for, 
He's not good enough. It's simple as. We could have won this game as well, but it just didn't take our chances as much as we needed to. And it's the bloody same carbon copy almost. Minus VAR. I thought, by the way, we should have had a penalty there when Ndombele got knocked over. So, again, I think that's some poor refereeing there. But we just have to move on. Um, rely on more teams to drop points. It was there for the taking, and we didn't take it. That's the summary of it. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe. I don't even care anymore. And uh, hope you enjoyed the vlog.